It's right behind me. We're at the P&G home and we gave an exclusive tour of this 65,000 square foot facility, which is, by the way, I think I'm actually gonna stay here, don't tell them, but this can be my home for the games. But behind me is the Duracell Virtual Stadium and I've been a part of the Rely on Copper to go for the gold program for about five months. And I've been talking about this virtual stadium and it, it was so exciting for me today to be able to unveil it and get a chance to see it. And it makes such a difference. It's an opportunity for, for everyone at home to cheer on Team USA by going on facebook.com backslash Duracell and clicking on virtual stadium or through YouTube. And you send a text, a picture, a video, get really creative, you could win a prize. But, but the biggest prize is making a difference in the lives of these athletes. And it really does make a difference. If you're a sports fan and you've ever been to a game with home court advantage, then you know what I'm talking about. And this is P&G and Duracell's way of giving the athletes the home court advantage. It's huge. And speaking from personal experience in 1992, we didn't have cell phones and we didn't have email, but I did get a telegram from a woman in Texas who I'd never met and none of my family knew, but she just felt compelled to tell me that she believed in me and she was wishing me good luck and she knew I could do it for my final race, which happened to be my gold medal race. And I'll never forget that. I have it in my scrapbook, my Olympic scrapbook at home. It was a really special moment for me. And that was one telegram. So the virtual stadium behind me is like a million telegrams, 10 million telegrams to all of Team USA and specific athletes really cheering them on. And it, it does make a difference. When we're talking the difference between gold and silver and one one hundredth of a second, this could be the difference. In 92, like you think about it, the cell phones were huge, athletes were just walking around. We thought that people were watching us and cheering for us through the TV screen back home, but you didn't really know. You didn't know until somebody sent you that message. And that, I mean, it was interesting how it really did open my eyes to how many people were affected by the Olympic Games. I did. My kids are four and six, um, and we stumbled upon it on TV, and they, uh, they actually, so they know it. And, and it's funny, it's cute, because they'd say, Mommy, wasn't this the show that you used to host? And I said, yeah, it is, it is. It's fun to see it, and I love the fact that a new generation is getting to enjoy it. Um, I'm partial to our era of Figure It Out. I loved Lori Beth and Danny and all their antics, and it was really fun, but I... I am enjoying playing the game with this version of Figure It Out and seeing the slime once again.